What about the notion of teaching ethics in an MBA class? What do you think? Fine, uh, but we're kidding ourselves if we think that that's actually a solution. So fine, but useless. Fine, not useless, but of limited use, put it to you that way. Because a lot of these people that are, are uh, let's say we, we reduce it down to what I believe is that 1% or less that actually were acting unethically. In the vast majority of cases, these aren't people that didn't know what the ethical path was. These weren't people that didn't know how to apply ethical principles decision making. They broke the law in many cases. And I think in some way sitting back saying, well, we've really got to go back and teach the kids how to think ethically is a little <laughs> bit naive. And again, diverts us away from something that Gerard was talking about, which is building into the system incentives that are focused on long-term health. And fundamental questions like that social contract to operate uh, that, that we really don't do a very good job of, of operating towards at all. We're very, very focused on the short term. And that's where you get into things that the broad public at large tends to interpret as uh, a failure of ethics, which in my view are actually a failure to assess the long-term risks to the business.